Right, the next presenter is Alex Cowdery from AAM Hatch. And uh, he's going to talk to us about some advanced 3D modeling uh, and very cool stuff. So, just a show of hands, who here uses aerial photography in their business? I mean, most of us, right? Almost everybody. What about 3D stuff? 3D buildings or 3D terrains? Fewer people? Well, Alex is going to show us some really, really cool stuff. Totally blows away all the kind of things we're thinking about when we think about aerial photography or 3D. So, welcome, Alex Cowdery. Thank you. <clears throat> Thanks, Dave. Thank you to uh, yourself and Gloria for a uh, wonderful evening tonight. So, um, here we go. So, I, I represent AM Hatch, and I'm going to talk about pictometry images and the derived advanced 3D modeling that can occur from that. So, are there intelligent images? <clears throat> can do you know before you go? Can you measure and plan before you get there? With pictometry, I say yes. So, this is the aerial capture system. Uh, this is how it works it simultaneously captures. Uh, from the five digital cameras, one orthogonal and five oblique. As those angles are constant, uh, processing allows uh, all features in the oblique and orthos to be located and measured. So if you're a location anywhere within the flight plan, this is how you will be captured. And the result is a pictometry warehouse. So this is a pictometry 12 centimetre GSD ortho image of Piedmont Point in Sydney. So using this as a base map, I'm going to say this can be used and it will be misleading. Because the visual intelligence from the pictometry oblique images, you can see that the grass and the roads aren't connected. There are units underneath uh, the grass just there. And um, viewing all of these images is truly busy with So pictometry can be viewed in um, numerous software options. So you can view north, east, south, west, uh, and straight down, determine height, or you can see all five images in the one screen. And here are some of the tools that can be used and integrated. Uh, so we'll just have a look at some of these tools. So this is a distance tool. Uh, airing, areas and bearings can also be located, calculated. That's the location tool just there. And then a height tool. Elevations can also be checked or an address search. So there's a couple of vendor software plugins that uh, have been developed. You can see the pictometry tools down the middle of the ArcMap page here. And then the pictometry images can be viewed either from a local storage or from an online storage in this example here. Um, third example here, uh, we've actually done our own mashup uh, called GeoVisor from AA and Hatch. Uh, you can see the image and the height tool and distance tools being used here. So what are some of the uses of photometry? <coughs> so better understanding of local area for real estate valuation and purchasing, visualising property from all angles for better decision making. So in this real life example here, the location of a ASCAM story is right next to, uh, to the fire. So the overlaying of any other spatial data and getting that out to the field is uh, fairly important. Um, pictometry imagery can assist in the locating of emergency callers. So if you had a caller somewhere in that car park, the operator, uh, the phone operator can actually use the five images to say, well, which part are you actually in? So from these images, you can identify and measure power lines, telegraph poles, vegetation curbs, uh, drains for road and rail infrastructure planning, overlay field survey data for quality, contr for quality control or vice versa. So you can really just view your location in detail. Once again, for critical infrastructure, just view everything from every angle. Also use the imagery with existing emergency toolkits to invent and emergency management. We plan for operational phases before you get there. Execute these plans and create an advanced uh, operation uh, situation awareness. So tools can be used for master planning. 
local environment planning or law enforcement site assessment before you get there. So getting to the, uh, the nifty stuff. So we can do 3D models from the pictometry images. They're highly accurate, geo-referenced, cover large areas, show significant rooftop shapes, slopes, ridges and domes. They have photo accurate textures, have a very short production cycle. So in this example here, we've got about 4,000 buildings. It's about four or five weeks to uh, set a beer. <laughs> Delivered in a coordinate system of your, of your choice, provided in wide variety of formats, Esri's model catch, KML, 3DS, OpenFlight, VRML, OBJ, used for advertising, virtual visits, telecommunications, uh, sky's the limit really. So in summary, pictometry, georeference, metric, intelligent images from AM Hatch are here now. You can see everything in about your area. Know what's there before you leave. Quality control once you get back. Measure anything and then create an advanced 3D model. Use the images with provided software or bring your own. So the end result is superior decision making and excellent customer service. Thank you.